So welcome to the second half of your practice. We finished standing. We're going to repeat that song, Salala, and have a great time doing it. So we find the whisper of the breath. We get ourselves started. And the arms begin to circle. Knees soften. And it's not a flailing of the arms. Each inch of that circle is known, is traveled. We roll through the shoulder sockets. We loosen the tops of the shoulders. We deepen and lift the breath. The eyes close. We become very steady. And if it's too much into your shoulders, you bend your elbows, rolling through the wrists and the hands. It can be very small. You're working into the space around you, the circulation increasing, the movement in your body and around your body, shifting, working together. starting to reach out into the fingers, into the sides of that circle, feeling the space along the back and under the shoulder blades. Get softer through your shoulders rather than creating more work. Soften and roll without windmilling, without force. Steady, graceful, blossom. establishing your frequency for today. That no matter how you woke, no matter how you arrived at your mat, your breath, this upward current of movement is settling you a little higher and a little clearer. Three. Two. Hands high. Inhale up. Open the whole front body. Sip in a little bit more. Hold. Let your chin drop. Reach. Heart high. Chin lightly in. And on the exhale, your hands descend. Palms open. Feeling into the space around you and within you. down onto your back. <clears throat> so setting your blocks aside, feet flat to the floor, and if you choose having some padding underneath you, it's really great. Now you'll bend your elbows. Set the elbows right down beside the ribs, feet flat and heels under the knees, palms face each other. Press the elbows into the floor to rise up, and exhale down. In and up. Out and down. You can turn your palms towards you. As you lift your hips, reach your hands a little bit away from the head. Open the palms.
three. Set it down and roll right over onto your belly. With your fingertips wider than the mat, elbows right above the wrists, you widen the elbows, walk the thighs back and the base of the big toes towards each other, anchor your tail, peel up, and exhale, roll down. Inhale towards Cobra. Yours might be just inches off the floor. Inhaling, opening, exhaling, rolling down. Keep clarifying the legs. Keep reaching into the toes. Keep saddling the hips into the floor. So there's no force, but there's an elevation to the heart and to the head. Opening all the channels of the front body. Adding on, you may bend your knees as you come down and then straighten out to rise. Exhale down, straightening, right? As your legs straight and keep them there, anchor your tail. Walk the thighs a little bit closer. Base of the big toes may touch and rise up. And you'll find a little breath of fire. Little whispers, exhales right out the nose. As you do, firm the legs, tail into the floor, toes long, legs very, very straight. So the work is in the legs. The heart is high and firm and clear. Palms are open, arms are long. As you exhale, bring your attention to your feet. Inhale from the sole of your left foot right up to the crown of your head. And from your exhalation, go from the crown of your head out your right foot. From the right foot in and up to the crown. from the crown out through the left foot. In and up, left foot to crown. Out and down, crown to the right foot. One more, right foot to crown. Crown to the left foot. Normal breathing. Walk your legs in. Hold your shins. Wag a little. Relieve your low back. And we'll roll forward. And we'll roll back. <clears throat> we'll roll up to stand. And as you do, bring your hands behind your head. Bending your knees. Saddle down. Feel the feet. Inhale, rise tall. Feel the crown of your head. Exhale, saddle. Inhale, rise. The knees stay in parallel. Elbows are wide. Spine is steady and straight. We just go for five more. 
settling down and unfolding. Fall into the feet. Inhale, stand tall. See if you can find the breath right from the feet. Inhaling up to the crown of the head. Crown of the head down through the body to the feet. The next time you come down, settle into a cross-legged seat. If you like, stack a block, give yourself a little height. And begin that soft breath of fire and circles. Eyes closed, breath steady and light, and circling your hands. Circling your fingers, elbows may be bent, soften your shoulders and begin to move through your body in the way that you would live today. Like a great blessing all around you, the arms may grow in their circles the space around you may grow brighter and emboldened and possible. grow, but without force, just for five, and for four, for three, two hands high in and up, lift the chin, sip in more, hold, heart is high, let the chin descend, reach the arms, lift the heart, Lift the chin to exhale, shoulders down, elbows down, hands down, heart high. And pause. So this is our alignment, the wisdom of the gut. What we know at an intuitive, instinctual, internal level. The emboldening of the heart. bringing courage, bringing sensation, bringing love, and the direction of the mind, allowing each of these parts of ourselves to do their separate work, and yet working together to give us what we need, aligned into what's beyond us. So bring your palms together to finish out. Just one last place here. On the inhale, your hands open, reaching the palms apart. <clears throat> On the exhale, you bring your palms together and down. On the inhale, your hands widen. And on the exhale, your hands slide back in. As your hands separate, there's a sensation of expansion between the hands, beyond the body, and the arms start to explore, reaching a little further each time and sliding back together, settling. Follow your breath. Extending the arms as you can. All the way out through the fingertips.
sensation of being limitless, expanding beyond what we know of ourselves. Two more, just that way. Expanding beyond what we expect in our day. We are so vast. And so supportive. to fall back together, to pause and have the sensation continue even without our movement. And as your hands descend, you may choose to stay here for a seated meditation, or you may choose to lie back finding your shavasana if possible for the duration of the track here on the playlist but whenever you need to return roll to your seat as we are now palms together hands to the forehead center sat nam thank you for your practice use it well <laughs>